Good evening, everyone. Happy Halloween. Welcome back to Fatal Frame. I'm super freaked out by everything. Okay. Oh, we picked up the tape recorder. Cannot use it here. Audio tape with a white label. It was in the tape recorder. Oh, geez. Do we want to use this? September 9th, 5.40 p.m. The mansion was nowhere to be seen on the map, so we finally had to ask the locals how to find it. They told us that Himuro Mansion had been empty for several decades now. The same ones who told us where it was also warned us not to come here, which was quite disconcerting. Huh, okay. We can actually listen to these. We might find more audio clues as we go. Okay. Let's go take pictures of some ghosts. I don't know if this game is going to have, like, lots of jump scares. It's got to have some, right? I know there's two big complaints about the game that I have seen. One is that the camera controls are a little bit wonky and that later in the game things move real fast and they're real hard to like, ah, oh, get, your, get your camera, get your camera out, find the thing, oh, it's behind you, turn around and like, where's picture? And like, it can be really, really tricky to manage that. So that's one common complaint from when I was looking at uh, like reviews and stuff before I started the Let's Play. The other thing I know is that there's apparently just a crap ton of backtracking and compared to like modern game aesthetics, the amount of backtracking in this game has put people off. They don't like it. The door on this side is broken. Is that Powerful force. Great. There's a person or a ghost or a dead body in there. There's a sparkly in the door here. And another boarded up door. Alright, sure. More herbal medicine. Nailed shut. I hate these camera angles. I hate these camera angles. I hate these games. The stupid survival and the horror and... Oh, oh, oh. The sound. The sound is actually the thing that's really getting to me here. The camera angles, too. Like, I don't know. If I wouldn't play Resident Evil, I would also be very freaked out. Any of them. Any, well... Probably not the action-y ones. I would be... St still very freaked out, even though I'm mostly I'm very familiar with Resident Evil 1 and 3 to a certain extent. Nemesis. Because I watch speedruns. There's like a like a sparkly? An old kimono hangs here. It's faded and dusty. But the red lining is still vivid. Yeah, even knowing a little bit of what to... Mr. Takamine Tomoe, where have you both gone? That was that was the ghost. Okay, so we're we're on the trail of the editor. When that heartbeat sound happens, by the way, my controller's vibrating. It's pulsing a little bit with that too. So that's freaky. It's vibrating right now. Those are freaky kimonos. Those are freaky kimonos. Something. Yeah, we're, we're vibrating. There's something here. Those are freaky kimonos. Why is it, like, evil looking?
It's the sounds. The audio design here is what's really getting to me. Looks like a small mirror stand, but the mirror is missing. The drawer is locked. I'm also playing with headphones on because I'm a masochist and I hate myself. Oops, not that. There we go. Oh, run button. Man, the controls are just going to keep throwing me for a loop in this game also. Okay, that is what... There's something here. Or not here. It's... There's a... There's a clue, right? It's turning blue. There's... There's a something here. Is it on the other side? I don't know. Are they gonna move on their own? Is something behind there... Is it gonna jump out at us? I don't like this room. I don't like the... Anything. Oh, jeez. What's happening now? That was, a, that was a photo moment. That was a good one. That was like a crit. We got a critical photo hit. The camera began to glow with mystical power. The camera's seal. Power-ups. This was also mentioned briefly in the manual that these exist. So, you could acquire mystical power by damaging ghosts. Okay. Select camera from the menu screen and to access the power-up screen. You can unlock the seal on the camera with accumulated mystical power and power up. Oh, okay. I didn't know how power-ups worked. I know that there are, like, special abilities on the camera. Take a photo that pushes the enemy back or that slows them down or stuns them. Things like that. Uh, okay. About auxiliary functions. Yeah, here we go. Auxiliary functions. When you unlock Auxiliary Functions seals, you enable many special attacks. To use the enabled Auxiliary Function, apparently we have to like equip one at a time or something. I don't know. Press the L1 button while shooting, while, or while in a shooting stance. The number of Auxiliary Functions you can use is limited to the number of spiritual stones in your inventory. So be frugal. Yeah, so we have like basically ammo for these. So is this a spiritual stone? Oh, white tape too. The audio tape with the white label seems to be okay. Good, I'm glad it's okay. What on earth ghosty picture kill? Oh, okay, so because I saved and quit, we're in a new recording session, by the way. Um, wow, my PlayStation 2 actually has accurate like an accurate date, even though it's not accurate time. That's neat. Uh, <laughs> um, I didn't save our photo album from the previous recording session, so... There we go, square. Okay. So our old photos are gone. So this is from the kimono room. Ah, okay, that was actually the editor's ghost. That's the editor. So do we have like a new... We know about that, I don't really care. Back, photos, no, correlation. We don't know anything about him being a ghost now. Okay. Um, camera. We have loaded film. Oh, we can upgrade the performance. 
Is there a way to see... Special functions? Bonus functions? Unlocks the auxiliary functions. Use the L1 button to add auxiliary functions. Slash selecting abilities. Oh, Basic performance? Raises the camera's maximum value, speed, and range. And change what film you have loaded. What is happening? We have no stones. Oh, so our mystical power is the score. Oh, so we have 2,567 power. 6,000 to increase the maximum charge value of mystical power. Which is when we were focusing on him and it was like going swoosh, 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 swoosh. And we were getting things and that's a whole thing. I'm assuming there will be like another tutorial for that later. Um, speeds up how quickly we get those. Basically, I think my understanding of this is, again, have I mentioned this is a blind playthrough? Um, my understanding is I, I, I think if we hold the camera on the ghost, it like charges up as long as the ghost is in focus and the more it charges the more damage we do and also I think the more points we get out of it uh, widening the capture circle though that seems like it's going to be crucial <clears throat> so what do we got here pressure push, push ghosts back slow will slow down the ghost's movement for a limited time C makes the ghosts more visible is that even what do you, what what does that even mean? Oh. Paralyze will stop them and search will search for locations of ghosts and track them automatically. Fourteen thousand, twenty thousand, twelve, eighteen, sixteen. Huh. Okay, and then special function, I'm assuming we have to get I like that that you can't do this noise. It's like a creaky floorboard or something. Um, I'm assuming that these will be like key items or something tied to the story. I don't know. Who knows? All right. This was a window, right? Wait. Tightly nailed shut. I cannot open it. Cool. Creepy kimonos everywhere. Door. Sounds. Oh, that's the sound of. Yeah. Okay. I gotta get used to the game. I gotta. We gotta. We gotta learn like the vocabulary of Fatal Frame. So that sound is that there's a clue. Yeah. Okay. Everything's all wobbly here. See how wiggly it is. I'm hoping that actually comes from the video. Okay, and then we have the blue dot up in the, the top center of the screen. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, I think I understand. Let's take a picture. Is the mirror actually there? What's in the picture? Something shows in the photo. It looks like the lion mask near the sunken fireplace. I put the photo on my phone. Oh my gosh, I'm... My other problem is I've been playing other video games because that's what I do. I'm a nerd and I play games and they have different control schemes and the this one is going to keep throwing me off. I'm going to be hitting the wrong buttons. That's what I get for playing things on the PS4. The mirror has been removed from the mirror stand. The drawer is locked and won't open. The The pulsing vibration of the controller is also freaking out a little bit. Uh, wait, there's a, there's a door here, right? Wait. It doesn't look like there should be. Wait, was that a, not a door or was it just a chunk of the wall? This. Doesn't that look like a door, like a secret door or something right there? Right there. Seems like that should be a door. Is this anything? An old kimono chest. Door. 
Door, please. Door, please open. See, it's the sounds. What's behind me? What's behind me? What, 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 what? Is that a ghost? You're a ghost. 50 damage. Why? Why, why, why? Oh my gosh. Okay, that was fun. <laughs> why? I want... I don't even know what I want. Speed? Range? Oh. Well, I want range. We'll save. We'll save for range. Okay, let's listen to the tape. There we go. That's what I was remembering. We picked up a tape. September 9th, 9.40 p.m. It seemed dangerous to walk through the mountain at night. So we decided to spend the night here and continue our work. I've been through several rooms already. Unlike the exterior, the interior is still in quite good shape. A little earlier, I thought I saw a white shadowy figure of a woman in the hallway near the entrance. I'll keep track of such sightings and publish them in a later account. gonna publish a later account of the ghost lady question mark or just any ghosts that he sees uh photo oh, oh, oh whose picture did we get was it the editor again it is the editor again <laughs> 31 242 all right that last one was pretty good so is it just one or like only a couple ghosts at a time? Like, is this also the direction we need to go? I think it is. I see flashlight, Ugh. camera angles. Are we just dealing with the editor right now? Maybe. He fall prey to the strangling ritual. All right. Well, this is the the thing that we saw when we took our photo. The, the lion's head mask thing. I don't know. Um, I guess we need to interact with this, and we'll do that next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. Happy Halloween. May the grace of the Twilight Dragon be with you. So, fun fact, I'll just stick this in at some point real quick. Apparently, if you just leave the pause menu up for a little bit too long, this happens. I went up to get some water and... Wow. Wow. All right. Well, great. I love it. Oh, this game.